Hey guys, it's Everett Liz here from Zenith62.com and these are my 2012 Best Picture winner for the Oscars. Okay, number one, The Artist. is about this old film, black and white old film. These actors uh, try to deal with the transformation between silent films and talk to films and they're just having a lot of trouble because they're not the most popular kid on the block. Next movie, The Descendants with uh, George Clooney. I'll watch anything with George Clooney in it, but uh, it's about a husband who uh, loses his lying, cheating, skanky hoe of a wife um, in an accident, but he's in fine getting everything on until afterwards, so um, I'm going to have to go with no, this isn't winning. Um, and Screamly Loud and Incredibly Close. Next, uh, Moneyball. Um... But with uh, Brad Pitt, he's the head coach of the Oakland A's baseball team who has little to no budget, kind of like the current Oakland A's right now. Sorry, Oakland, even though I'm an Oakland resident. Uh, with Jonah Hill, mathematician, helps us win, blah, 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 blah. They get the longest winning streak in baseball. I love baseball, but uh, doesn't win for me. Uh, the Tree of Life, also with Brad Pitt. It's about uh, this aggressive, abusive father who raises his kids, troubled kids. Um, gets really deep. It was a really good film, but I'm going to have to go with no. The Help. It's about this journalist who uh, chronicles the life of these African-American maids during the beginning of the Civil Rights Movement. Um, beautiful film. Have a soft spot for maids because my mom's a maid. But no, I don't think it wins. Um, War Horse. Boring. <laughs> no, 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 no. Midnight in Paris. Owen Wilson. Um, no, he doesn't win there. Rachel McAdams. She's a great actress. She's pretty much in every romantic film. But uh, I'm going to have to go with No Here. And Hugo, produced and uh, screenwriter and directed by Martin Scorsese. Great director. Um, totally transforms you, takes you to another place. This Parisian kid who lives in this train station. Uh, just daydreams about these employees who work at the train station. And uh, just kind of takes your mind to a different place. Like Kind of like if you were on shrooms. Like that's the type of movie I would want to see. So, those are my predictions. Hugo wins the Oscar, 2012 Oscar. And uh, you can catch me on Twitter at B-E-V-R-I-B-A-S and at Zinni62.com. Hugo, best artist. No, sorry. Whitney Houston, best artist. Rest in peace, Whitney Houston. Hugo, my number one.